Hey, hey, so it's another beautiful week. Welcome to my vlog and thank you so much for watching. So over the last couple of weeks, I've been feeling pretty down lately. I wondered what might be the problem. Why am I feeling like I'm being attacked? I realized that sometimes I look at what everybody else has and I get down in the dumps and I start thinking to myself, why don't I have any of those things? Specifically, I'm in a minivan, I want a truck. I want a boat, I want a dirt bike, I want an RV and I don't have an RV. Rather than thinking about the things that I do have, the wonderful things that I have in my life, just like many people, I start to only think about those things that I don't have. My mind naturally goes to being more materialistic when I know that that's not what brings fulfillment to life. I do get fulfilled by the experiences and I feel like to a certain degree, having some of those things would give me new experiences to have with my friends and my family. It'd just be really fun to be able to go camping and things like that. And so I start feeling bad because I'm like, oh no, you're not getting that experience. I need to remember the things that I do have. I need to continually strive to not only remember the things that I have and to be thankful for the things that I have. Everything that I just said that I like, not one of those were an actual thing. I love the trips that we take. I love the games that we play. I love being able to go to the beach with my girls. I love to be able to go out and celebrate somebody's birthday. Those aren't things. So why am I getting so upset because I don't have a few things? It's funny and it's, it's really counterproductive. And then another thing that I've been really thinking about for the last couple of weeks is I want to be more present with other people. I want to think about them not just myself. And I want to think about their feelings, not just mine. I want to build, I want to continue to build up my heart for other people. You know, this is something that's been ongoing for at least seven to 10 years, something like that. I have been working on trying to better my life for a long time. Some of these lessons that I learn, and I'm sure that everybody's like this, it's almost like it's cyclical. It comes up over and over again, like, oh yeah, I, I forgot that I'm supposed to not think about materialistic things. Oh yeah, I forgot. I'm supposed to like try to not to just care about other people but try to like lift people up some of these things you'd think they're like inherent in you but they're not my natural set of ideals is that I tend to like focus on the bad things and I don't want to focus on the bad things so you know today I'm taking care of my little baby girl my little daughter she's asleep right back here uh, right there so since she's asleep I decided that you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go visit my son and so right over there there's my boy coming here reminds me that you know there's so many good things in this world and there's so many terrible things in this world and there's so many good events that happen and there's so many terrible events that happen you got to try to put yourself in a place where not only are you remembering what you do have and the good things in life but you're also remembering and you're also focusing on the people and experiences around you that just make life better. To my wife, I love you so much. To my kids, I love you so much. To my little son, Leo, up in heaven, I love you so much. To the rest of my family uh, who's still here, I love you guys. To my uh, family up in heaven, I love you guys. To all my friends, past, present, and future, I love all of you. You all make me who I am. You all help remind me to be a better person. You all have contributed to the person that I am and how I'm able to hopefully help other people and be caring for other people and treat other people well. Sometimes I'm gonna fall into that trap of being negative. Sometimes I'm gonna fall into that trap of being materialistic. And I think it's only human. So with that said, I hope that you guys have a wonderful week. Happy summer and pretty soon it's fall. All right, take care.